From network switches to medical imaging to big data and storage, the performance of PCI Express often plays a critical role in maximizing the overall system performance. I'll be showing two performance demos using the PCI Express hard block available in Kintex UltraScale and Vertex UltraScale families. The first demo is as designed with the sole purpose to move as much data across the PCI Express link as possible. The second demo is an off-the-shelf DMA engine and software driver that is typically used in a PCI Express endpoint. In both performance demos, I'll use a Kintex UltraScale PCI Express board. The first demo was called XBMD, and it is used as part of the extensive hardware validation process for Xilinx PCI Express blocks. XBMD was developed internally at Xilinx specifically to stress the PCI Express block with as much data as possible. I'll use XBMD here to show the bandwidth that can be achieved in a completely optimized PCI Express system. The demo is set up to run at Gen 3 by 8 and is already loaded into the system and ready to use. I'll start by enabling only writes. In this case, a write is sending data from the PCI Express card to the system memory. This test sends the same data to the same address location over and over. The PCI Express block can achieve a very impressive bandwidth of 7 gigabytes per second with this specific use case. Next, I'll enable just reads that will send a read request from the PCI Express card to the system memory. The read will result in completion packets coming back to the PCI Express block. Limiting the reads to a single page size allows the test to maximize the amount of data being received. The data rate for reads is 6.9 gigabytes per second. The XBMD demo showed the kind of performance that can be achieved by the PCI Express block for very specific use cases. While some customers may be able to achieve these PCI Express data rates for specific types of applications, other customers will choose to purchase an off-the-shelf DMA engine to speed their time to market and reduce their development cost. Xilinx has partnered with industry leaders Northwest Logic and PLDA to ensure that their DMA IPs work seamlessly with the PCI Express block for UltraScale. Both of these IP providers have high-performance DMA engines that are available now. In the second demo, I'll use the back-end DMA engine from Northwest Logic to demonstrate a typical PCI Express use case. The demo uses the same KCU 105 board and the same system as the XBMD demo operating at Gen 3 by 8. I've set up the board with the new design and it's ready to run. In this setup, the DMA engine is connected to a traffic generator and checker. The key difference for this demo is that the system side software of this DMA engine is operating exactly how Linux expects a PCI Express application to work by scattering data throughout the PCI Express memory space. Software generates descriptors that are used to tell the DMA engine how to move data to and from the PCI Express card. The use of descriptors impacts performance for all full-featured DMA engines, but is also representative of how driver and application developers expect to interact with the PCI Express design. The first test performs just reads, transferring data from system memory to the PCI Express card that results in 49 gigabits per second. Next, I'll enable just writes, transferring data from the PCI Express card to the system memory that result in nearly 51 gigabits per second. The XBMD demo showed the high-end performance that the PCI Express block is capable of achieving, while the Northwest Logic DMA demo showed a typical performance of a DMA engine in a PCI Express system. Whether you are looking to squeeze out every last bit of performance of your system with a custom PCI Express design, or you need the ease of use of an off-the-shelf DMA, Xilinx and our partners Northwest Logic and PLDA have a solution to fit your needs. For more information about the entire Xilinx PCI Express solution, you can go to www.xilinx.com slash PCIe.